Welcome back to Waffle TV, sponsored by West Beer. This afternoon, I'm with Rory Murray, and he's performing his show this year um, after returning from last year. Now, how's it going this year? Yeah, my show this year is called Bath Time, and it's going very. I'm very pleased with how it's all going, actually. Yeah. Uh, I've been, uh, I've been getting. Uh, I got a hot show in the Scotsman, a uh, great review, and uh, the Herald's been very kind. So that's been wonderful, and. <laughs> The audiences have been good as well. I've, I've been able to build from my show last year, so uh, that's been fantastic. So hi, uh, I'm very pleased. And remind us what the genre. I've, I've read the reviews, and it's and it's apparently quite a dark comedy. And uh, how how different is that from last year? Um, well, last year was uh, my show last year called Big it was called Big Strong Mikey and Me. Um, it was uh, semi autobiographical. It was about myself. My childhood pal Mikey and my um, my imaginary friend Sean Connery. <laughs> I never had an imaginary friend called Sean Connery, but obviously uh, that was the vehicle for the show. Yeah, yeah. But um, so that was, like I said, uh, I mean, my, I I starred in my last show, but this year it's a it's a fictional piece. Yeah. Um, I, I've obviously drawn from experiences growing up in Edinburgh from uh, when I was younger, and it, it's very loosely based on a. Guys, I gr grew up with. Uh, it's about three guys that, uh, three pals, childhood pals that carry out a robbery, which they completely balls up, and it has dark consequences. Have they been to see the show yet? These three pals, or have they remained anonymous? No, I mean, they are. They are. They are. They're not. They're not really anyone, okay. if you know what I mean. The characters that yeah. I've invented. So, uh, but I have had friends turn up, and um, they've tried to. Well, they think they know who some people might be, <laughs> and you know, I've denied everything. But anyway. Yeah, so you've kept it to yourself so far. Yes. Very nice, okay. Brilliant. And what's it, how's, how's Edinburgh, how's the vibe this year compared yeah. to last year? Well, to me, it, it seems a little bit more, uh, it seems busier actually. Yeah. Uh, but uh, yeah, I mean, I had an amazing time last year. I was, I was delighted. Um, and yeah, like I said, I'm just, I'm really happy to be back to build on from last year with my new show. So. And will we expect you back next year? Uh, no, I've got I've got something um, bubbling away in the background, um, almost like I suppose a trilogy. Yeah. Um, so I, it'll it'll come from Edinburgh again, and um, I have one character that keeps resurfacing. So <laughs> I think he's got from the bathtub. From <laughs> big well, it's it's the the character loosely based on my, my childhood friend Mikey, and uh, he was a very charis charismatic soul. Uh, a bit of a, um, a rough diamond, but uh, I just, yeah, feel there's maybe something more, one, one more sort of uh, last dance for him. <laughs> Do you think you'll take bath time elsewhere after the Fringe? Will you take uh, it down south or abroad? I, I, would, I would like to. I had my, yeah. my London previews, uh, it was very well received, so and I was able to sell out, so that was great. So, um, yeah, I'd love to take it back to London, and who knows, we'll see... Uh, yeah, yeah, uh, but uh, no, I, you know, it's, um, I'm always thinking big, so. That's what I think, isn't it? <laughs> well, thank you very much for speaking to us today. Great best of luck for the rest of the Fringe. Thank you. And don't forget, to, we can catch you at 3.15 in the Gilded Balloon, which is this building right here. The Wee thank you. Thank you. This is Ross Jennings from Waffle TV, sponsored by West Beer.